Hi everyone, my name is Steph, this is Kid Lit Joy and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm here to review The Raven's Eye Runaways by Claire Maybe, which is a debut book by a New Zealand author. This is a middle fiction fantasy story, which on the back says a gripping, beautifully told fantasy quest set in a parallel medieval world. So that kind of sets the, the tone for the book for you. So this is the story of three friends. You have Getwin, who is a young girl who lives with her mother. They are bookbinders. And in this world, people have to have permission to be able to read and to write. And bookbinders make the books, but they may or may not be able to read the books. And there are fines imposed on this. Then you have Lee, who is a scribe, and she is sort of trapped in a place where she's the person who writes down the words, but she's also not allowed to read them. And then you have Buckle, who is Getwin's friend and becomes a bookbinder when they desperately need him to be, or a bookbinding apprentice. All three of them, their worlds converge when Getwin's mother goes missing and we find out that the powers that be in this world are trying to very tightly control everything to do with books and particularly with magic. And so Getwin, Lee and Buckle need to set out to not only find Getwin's mother but also to try and stop those in power from taking control. And along the way Getwin and Lee both learn that they have access to magic and to the ability to read. And their mission is unexpected and eventful and at times dangerous and they need to learn to rely on each other and to trust one another. And along the way they learn some truths about their world that perhaps shock them. This book is definitely for anyone who loves a middle grade fantasy story. It is really interesting. I always love when books play with the, the concept of language and who is allowed to read and write and the trouble that that brings to the world when someone tries to dictate who can and can't read and write. It also has a really unique setting. It does very much feel like a historical story set in a fantasy world and there are a lot of vivid descriptions and when it comes time when it, we find out about the magic in this world and how that magic is described it's deeply deeply fascinating. So yeah this was a really interesting book one that I wasn't expecting and one that I had a really great time reading and now I know a few kids who I can recommend this to. So that's always a, a really good thing that come out to come out of reading a middle fiction fantasy book. So if you would like more information about this book or the author, I will leave that link down below. Thank you again to the publisher for sending me a review copy. In the comments, I'd love to know, do you have any book recommendations for books that sound similar to The Raven's Eye Runaways? Feel free to let me know down below. Otherwise, if you just want to let me know that you're here, but you don't want to leave a comment, feel free to leave a raven emoji down below. I hope that wherever you are in the world, just staying safe and healthy, and I will see you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye everyone.